I think when you look at these factors that have been researched and we think about which ones to pick, whether it's dividend tilts or the size premium or price to book, there are a lot of ways of getting to the same place. Um, but often what we find is that some of the ways of getting to that same place could be more cost effective than others. Uh, an example I would give, uh, coming back to the equal weighting concept or you know, fundamental indexing, which is just a, a cute way of doing value investing. You're sort of you know, tilting your portfolio to either size or value. Um, but what happens with those strategies is they tend to have higher turnover than more of a simple price to book strategy. So, or a dividend tilted strategy tends to have higher turnover than a price to book strategy and it's another form of value investing. So if one wanted to create a low cost, low turnover, stable value strategy, uh, might it be the most you know, effective to create a price to book strategy versus price to dividends? Now, that's a question we don't have to answer here, but I think as portfolio managers, strategists, and researchers, that's something we're always thinking about. How do we get the investor to the place we want to get them to in the most cost-effective way?